For any aspiring small or medium-sized business, just getting off the ground is a formidable challenge. So when up and running, a guiding hand to help take the next steps can be very welcome. The University of Bedfordshire Business School aims to help businesses expand and prosper, benefiting local people, the community and, of course, the business itself. Helena Carter has this report from Luton. The University of Bedfordshire Business School is doing what it does best, helping companies make a splash. At Happy Tiddlers, a swimming school for children and adults, including children with disabilities, their success is hugely thanks to the university. We met with some people at the university quite early on in our plan to open a centre um, and they helped us not only identify um, whether it would be the right thing to do but where it should be um, and also helped us with getting a grant to fund the beginning of the build which has been amazing. We went from around 230 swimmers to 500 swimmers within year one, and it's still growing. We've got an excellent reputation. We get most of our customers through referral, and, and we really do believe we wouldn't be doing this now if we hadn't had that support. It really has made a massive difference working with them. And it's made a massive difference to the families who come here. Since we've been in the centre, it just feels, it feels like family. Um, it's just really nice atmosphere, the kids love coming, um, so yeah, it just, it, it lends itself to be quite conducive to learning to swim, <laughs> as one pops up. And this is the home of business opportunities. The University of Bedfordshire Business School is more than a business educator and degree provider. It nurtures knowledge and encourages the correct business practice. So tell me how the business school has progressed in the last two years. Initially, projects that we were dealing with, with uh, mainly small and medium enterprises, focused on those companies that were in the earlier stages of their development. We're starting to see businesses coming to us looking for expansionist strategies, product diversification strategies, uh, new ways of marketing the uh, goods, services or products that they have available to them. So we're starting to see companies who are rejoining us or coming to us for the first time, but they are themselves established. The school is at the heart of so many local businesses, having a big impact on regional economic regeneration and growth. In this particular region of the UK, there's a heavy reliance on smaller manufacturing type companies. And I think a lot of these companies feel relatively uh, lonely and uh, adopt a sort of standalone approach to their business growth. And I think once they start to realise that there's a larger uh, network out there of people who perhaps they thought were competitors, they can start to realise that knowledge exchange and starting to share and some of those ideas for growth uh, isn't a, a sort of area for conflict, it's, it's an area for opportunity and growth. Sajil was a student here and he's now a lecturer, helping businesses grow by going digital. My area of specialty is social media and online marketing and digital business sort of thing. So I have given advice to businesses on, OK, if you're on social media, maybe you should do, um, you know, you should have this type of content or you should have consistency across various different platforms. These are some of the advice we normally give. It's not the case of you wanting to be there, but it's more about you need to be there because that's where your audiences are. And that's and, and it's a quicker and easy way to attract them as well. So. It's a win-win situation, in a way, yeah. Here, they were the first to become part of the business school impact system, ensuring they gain feedback from those they've helped along the way. The value that we offer to the, the local environment, it runs into millions. Uh, the impact that we have in the international environment, likewise so. Um, and unless you take the time to consider your place within uh, your local community, as well as within the university, you don't fully appreciate the kind of benefit that you confer, and therefore the necessity to maintain that benefit going forward. And going forward, it's all about this. We get our benefits from working with you. We want to work with business, not just tell people about business. So for these business users, what's their verdict? Ten. 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 Ten.